I just received my call sign from the FCC as an amateur operator a few minutes ago. And I'm going to make my first transmission as an amateur operator using my newly acquired Bofag GT3 handheld radio. So let's give it a shot and see how it works. I've got it tuned to the local repeater here in Hot Springs, Arkansas with the correct off offset. It's 146.88 with a negative offset of 600 kilohertz. So let's give it a shot, see how it goes. This is KK4ZHG listening, transmitting for the first time as an amateur radio operator. I just heard somebody say this is their first time on amateur radio, and I just wanted to welcome you to the hobby. Uh, my name is David. Uh, my call sign is Whiskey Five Mike Zulu, and I just want to say congratulations and welcome to the hobby. David, this is Frank uh, KK4ZHG. Thank you for the welcoming, and uh, just curious how my radio was transmitting here. I'm on a handheld at low power here at uh, Lake Hamilton and um, just wanted to see how it was working. Mike, it sounds like a base rig uh, running a kilowatt. Uh, you were full quieting, uh, perfect modulation, beautiful audio. Um, <laughs> it just doesn't get any better than that. <laughs> Well, David, that, that's good to hear. I'm probably not too far away from the repeater. Uh, I'll be interested in uh, doing a lot of transmission over uh, the next future here um, as an operator. I'm, I live in South Carolina, uh, but also have a house here in uh, Lake Hamilton, and I'll be looking to learn how to use Echolink to talk to friends and, and folks back and forth as we travel. That's fine business there. You can go to the club website, um, the Spy Amateur Radio Association Club, and um, copy this call sign down because that's basically all you need to know. Um, the site is wb5spa.org. That's Whiskey Bravo 5, Sierra Papa Alpha, and there's some information about uh, using our Echo Link node um, up on there. And um, a little bit more, you know, in general. And we can also help you um, get used to that Echo Link too. Uh, you just a technician, or uh, have you upgraded uh, uh, past that? Hey, David. Uh, thanks for that information. That's Whisco Bra Whiskey Bravo, uh, Sierra Papa Alpha dot org. Um, I understand. I'll look that up, information up. I am just a lowly technician, uh, but probably won't be too long before I get my general. Just passed the exam on Saturday here, and uh, thought it'd be a great idea. I'm going to look forward to seeing if I can talk my wife into getting her. Uh, license as well as sometimes we're often separated by a few miles for work and uh, be nice to be able to talk through the amateur radio system. Oh yes, fantastic Frank. It is absolutely an asset, uh, especially when uh, uh, you've got bad weather conditions and other things that might um, uh, knock phones out and stuff like that. You've got an alternate uh, emergency way to stay in touch and that's a wonderful thing. Well, stay in touch with me here. Uh, W5M says my call uh, because when you get uh, uh, ready to get on the uh, general class bands, uh, I've got a few nets uh, to uh, point you at that you'd absolutely love. Um, but that can wait till later. Just just remember to come back here and I'll tell you all about it there, brother. Well, thanks again, David. I appreciate the hospitality. It's fantastic. Uh, when I got my uh, motorcycle, one thing uh, that surprised me in, in a good way was uh, when you buy a motorcycle and you're going down the road, all the other motorcycle folks wave at you. You know, a little, little, maybe a, a little salute or something. And I instantly realized that I was part of a, uh, a club being a part of the motorcycle. So I'm feeling the same vibe here, and it's, it's good to feel. Thanks, David. I appreciate everything. appreciate hearing from you and uh sounds like you've been on the air 20 years brother you're an old pro at this already <laughs> so um, take care out there stay in touch my friend and go to my website too w5mz.com 
and it's got some more information about uh, you know various amateur radio related things. I got a bunch of links that are useful. Uh, you can stay in touch with me via email. And if you've got any questions about uh, Echo Lake or the hobby or anything else, uh, uh, definitely don't hesitate to uh, uh, ask away. Just send me an email. Uh, take care, Frank. I'm going to get out of here. Uh, it was uh, great making contact with you. This is W5MZ. Thanks again, David. I'll talk to you later. This is KK4ZHG. So that was it. That was my first contact. W5MZ. Uh, name's David. Uh, gave me a lot of really good information and uh, there's a lot to learn here, but it's going to be a lot of fun. All right. It's that simple. So here's a follow-up real quick to the my first transmission that I just made. I just received another transmission from uh, KF5ZOS, a guy named Steve, who also welcomed me and uh, had a short conversation there. So already you're making friends. It's a good thing.